a world champion against a German champion. Not on the pitch, but rather on a console. Christoph Kramer was at Gamescom last week and played FIFA 15 against the defending German champion at the virtual Bundesliga, Mirza Jahic. Kramer played with Germany, of course, putting himself in the lineup. The German champion chose Austria, the country of his birth. The lads are ready for kickoff, and from here on out, the emotions do the talking. After 90 minutes, they're locked at one all. Now we have to play extra time. I've got to make a change. And that change brought about victory for Kramer. Andre Schürrle came on to score the winning goal in a 2-1 victory. A win against the German champion. Not bad at all. I never expected to beat him. The new game is lots of fun. Now I've really proved the quality that I always say I have on whatever FIFA game. I think now I can justify saying that no one can beat me on FIFA. We'll go along with that for now, but what does the real Kramer have to say about his virtual self? It's all right. I have the producer's business card. I'm going to call them up later and tell them that they have to do work on my acceleration a little. It's only a game, and in real life, I'm not the quickest, but they could increase my acceleration on the game by two or three points. Otherwise, I'm happy with me. Good stuff, but let's get back to the real Christoph Kramer. After his huge development at Gladbach over the past year, Interest in him has spiked, and questions continue to crop up about his contract situation. He caused a stir in the media lately when he said that he felt like he was sometimes involved in modern-day human trafficking. In erster Linie muss ich mich natürlich auch entschuldigen, weil auch wenn es nicht so gemeint war und die öffentliche. First of all, I have to apologize, even if I didn't mean it like that, and it was unfortunately taken the wrong way. It's something I shouldn't allow to happen. I want to apologize for using the term human trafficking. I know what human trafficking is, and anyone who knows me or has even come across me before knows that I didn't mean it the way I said it. It's important for me to explain it, because the way it was taken was different from my opinion. Nevertheless, a term like that shouldn't slip out. I know that I have a privileged life and it has absolutely nothing to do with human trafficking. Kramer is now keen to focus on the sporting issues. After all, Borussia have a hugely important game on Thursday, the playoff first leg at FK Sarajevo. I don't know whether I'll be involved or not. I'm great in terms of fitness, but we have another game coming up on Sunday, and two games in a short space of time would be over the top. I have to make sure that I feel my way into the season and kick into gear properly. The manager decides whether I'll be involved or not, and he will talk to me yet. Nevertheless, I'm expecting an ugly game, so to speak. In an old stadium against a team like that, it really is pure football. There's so much at stake. We worked very hard last season to get ourselves to the Europa League playoffs, and now we want to get our ticket for the group stages. There is no better game than this. It's pure football in a great stadium where you really get the smell of football and old leather. I think it's going to be a real battle, and it's something you can only look forward to as a footballer. Well put, Christoph. Bring on Thursday.